It's Trainer Tip Tuesday, and I'm your trainer, Isaiah Kiefer. Today we're gonna to be going over the lactic leg day, a workout that's sure to get your legs burning. This has five movements. We're gonna go over each exercise individually, and then we're gonna go over the proper programming for this workout, so stay tuned, guys. All right, guys, so we're gonna head outside, and we're gonna go over the proper programming for this workout. So come on with me. All right, so for the lactic leg day, you're gonna start out with 15 air squats, and then you're gonna take a zero to 30 second rest. Then you're gonna roll right into 16 forward walking lunges. That's eight each leg. And then you'll take a zero to 30 second rest. Then you'll roll, roll right into 15 jumping air squats, and then take a zero to 30 second rest. Immediately following, you'll do 16 jumping lunges, eight each leg, and then you will from there, roll straight into a quarter mile run. And then after that, you will take a 30 to 120 second break, and that will be one round complete. You'll do four rounds of this. All right, so our first exercise is gonna be that basic air squat. Things you wanna focus on, keep a neutral spine, chest up, look straight ahead, let those knees fall to the toes, drop that butt down, try and reach 90 degrees flexion just like this and then we're also going to have a jumping uh, jumping squat which is going to be those same fundamentals and cues are applying we're just going to add that vertical jump with it so look just like this and if you explode your arms down with you on your way up that'll kind of help mental wise and also like a little bit of momentum uh, there for you in that explosion piece all right so for our third exercise it's going to be uh, walking lunges so I encourage you guys to take this workout outside and actually make those forward walking lunges. Um, but just basic fundamentals with that, you're gonna take a step down. We don't wanna take too shallow of a step and really be over your um, uh, knees over your toes there. It's okay for your knees if they get over your toes a little bit, it's not a big deal, but kind of feel around for the depth that you wanna take in that squat and just be alternating legs. And then, I'm sorry, the depth that you want for that lunge and then alternating legs each time and coming forward into that walking lunge um, if you're outside doing that. And then for the jumping lunge, it's gonna be the same movement and fundamentals and cues. It's just with a vertical explosion and this one will be a stationary movement. So be down and then just doing that transition over. Trying to get as much depth as you can. If you wanna tap your knees, if that hurts, you can go ahead and just get a little bit shower, try and get a little gap between your knees and the ground so you're not bending your knees up. And then that fifth exercise is just gonna be a run. 